mistake for Tracy Wayneman out of Canada. She's 18 years of age. She's in the second spot, hoping to hold on to at least the silver and maybe put some pressure on Debbie Thomas as far as the gold. Not only is this an emotional beginning, but it's a very emotional performance that Tracy is doing here at Skate America. Tracy stayed out of competition for the last two years, and she's just coming back. She had some problems in her family, some emotional problems, and boy, she has come back to this Skate America competition, and everyone loves her. She's a wonderful person, and she's a great skater, and she has done beautifully. Yesterday in the short program, she absolutely lit the audience on fire. someone who hasn't been training constantly and gotten into any doldrum. She's back and she's so happy to be here. Judy Blumberg, very interpretive hand movements. Tracy's known for enthusiasm, and I think it shows in her body, in her hands, her head. She really feels that music. And I think the love for this skating, and she said Miss Berka means the world to her, and it's a very, very special relationship. I think it's showing in her performance tonight. during the short program, all of the Canadian officials came out from the accounting room to watch her skate. You seem to get that relationship between music and skate much more with the United States skaters, with the Canadian skaters, and with some European countries, much more than the Soviet bloc skaters. It's more mechanical with them. Yes, again, I think it has to do with their training. They work so hard on the physical body and how it moves on the ice, which muscles cause what jumps to be good and, and high, and um, the rotation in the jumps. And we work more with what an audience would like to see and how the body actually moves when it feels music. What a comeback for Tracy Weyman. For technical merit, she receives marks ranging from 5.0 to 5.4, and for artistic impression, 5.2 to 5.5 to finish second in Skate America.